This type of heart or something similar to it may one day be the answer for victims of severe heart disease. It's made of stainless steel, plastic and rubber and is made to last at least 10 years. It was designed by the University of Utah's Division of Artificial Organs, which in the past has been partly responsible for the development of the artificial kidney and the heart-lung machine now used commonly in open-heart surgery. When used in humans, the artificial heart would be nuclear-powered. The doctors and scientists here have set a world record for keeping a calf living with the device. Well, our limiting problem is that we have a buildup of clotting or coagulation within the ventricles, and uh, this is the limiting factor at the present day. We are working on new surfaces and uh, new methods of uh, handling the blood clotting factors, and uh, we think that perhaps we'll have a heart uh, ready for man within a decade. That's tremendous progress, but there's still much more to be done before an artificial heart can routinely be placed into man. This is Bill Brown at the University of Utah in Salt Lake City.